Yeah, I can still get up here, even though it's already been completely destroyed and there's no intended way for me to get up here. Hi, everyone. Uh, welcome back to another episode of Ori and the Blind Forest. Today, um, wasn't expecting to have to record this video, but apparently the game suddenly decided I'm going to end here and... <laughs> I wasn't done playing yet, so today we are gonna die immediately and I have to go through all that again. Oh, this is where I had saved last? Oh, that is disgusting. There, that'll probably be a better save spot. So last time the game decided it was going to end, I wasn't done playing, and today I'm gonna start working on getting all the things I couldn't get before. And I'm also gonna stay alive if I could possibly help it. So, I've got things to collect, apparently some of them I still can, but there were a lot of gates that I could never quite open because I didn't have a new ability for them. And specifically, I mean a new ability. In between episodes, I decided to look up exactly what am I missing? Where was this last ability that I couldn't collect? Because something I did notice while going through the volcano and I didn't want to bring it up because it just seemed a little too not quite right was the fact that we didn't get a new ability while we were inside oh there we go we did not get a new ability while we were in the volcano and I was thinking surely they'll give me one at some point and then uh, the Kuro chase happened and I was just kind of you know a little occupied we'll say so I couldn't really bring it up at the time so this leads us to this point. I have gone online to look for where is this ability? Did I miss it somewhere? And apparently, the last two abilities in the game we don't have are ones that are not in the base game. Okay, that wasn't gonna work. Should have known. Thank you kindly for this. Just gonna leave you alone forever now. Please don't shoot me anyway. And it has been a while since I played, so you can probably tell by that kind of messed up little bit right there. Anyway, we need to get new abilities, and we have things that we need to collect. So, first thing to do, obviously, is save the game. Maybe we should have done that secondly. There's a whole bunch of wells. There's a whole bunch of wells. Let's start with... There is that one... No, there was there were these over here that I think I could get, but I couldn't, I couldn't quite make it over there. So, okay, this is going to be a little, tough, a little difficult to navigate. Here's where we want to go. Here's where we want to go. Sunken Glade. Now, by my recollection... A long time ago, and I just want to make sure real quick, because it actually has been a while since I played. I want to make sure that this wasn't something I could get before. No, wait, there was the thing up here. Yeah, I can't get that. Back in the first or second episode, there was a spot over here that I couldn't get to. Well, I could get to it, and it gave us a little bit more story, and then everything was dark inside, so... They didn't want me to go this way, and I went this way anyway, and now it's getting dark again. But we're a little bit brighter. Maybe we'll be able to make this work. Very much maybe. I don't know for sure that we definitely will. Oh boy. Well, there's one right above me, so... How to get this one? Oops. Certainly not that way. Here we go, here we go. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Already getting some stuff that we probably shouldn't have access to. By my understanding, this is a new path. Not part of the main story that was added in. And I don't know if it was a DLC type deal or if it was just an expansion for the definitive version. I don't immediately recognize that. But either way, somewhere in this, whoops, somewhere in this big old mess of a place 
is a new ability we're looking for. Can I get to that from over here? I'm gonna say no. I actually have no idea what that thing is supposed to be. Hey now, hey now, hey now, that was rude. Okay, yeah, that's... So, they're introducing a whole bunch of new stuff. That's fine. Can unlock that. I guess that's fine. And the first level enemy... First area enemies die really fast. Oops. Okay. The light from the spirit tree it was a gift from our kind. It was given to Naru, who stood by our side. Oh. That's cool, I guess. All right, give me this thing. Ah! So those are impassable walls that disappear in the light. Spectacular. All right. Well, I think what I'm going to do is set that down and then check my ability tree. Now, I was saying that... Where'd it go? Where am I? I was saying that this one seems like the best idea. But I don't need that in order to finish the game, I think. I've already completed it. Maybe there's going to be some super boss later on. However, a lot of this path is showing me where things are on the map. Ability cells, uh, makes life cells, energy cells, you can see through walls, yeah. If I'm gonna be trying to wrap up the game and get as much as I can before I'm done playing, that's the kind of stuff I want to unlock. Again, don't want to look for everything that there is in the game if I don't need to. But, at the same time, there's a bunch of good stuff that I want to try to find. Just because it makes me feel good. If I can't get everything, I'm okay with that. I don't want to punish myself. Push, push yourself, sure, in games, but don't, don't punish yourself. Alright, that was a uh, choice I made that was clearly not a good one. Okay, I think I've never made it onto that platform before. In fact, thank you kindly. And I fell down immediately. Okay, well here's the thing. If I made a save st spot right up there and that's going to take me forever to get back, I'm definitely going to take the death. Alright, give me this thing. And that is how I get in here. Thank you very much. Alright, now then. I can get in here at this point. Oh, that seems to turn that on, whatever that means. I'm okay with this. I don't know what I'm jumping to. Oh, don't, 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 don't. That actually didn't take away too much health, I'm surprised. Hey, hey now, hey now, hey now, hey now. Darn it, I... I can't really see what I'm doing. Nori is slippery, as we've already determined. Whoops, hold on, hold on now, hold on now. I know I lost a lot of health, but it's fine. Do I have to put this down? Where am I, even? Oh, is there something in there? Right, there's something back up there, isn't there? Well, crap. So much for that save point. Please, Ori, just... Remember, kids, I'm bad at platformers. It's not that I'm doing a bad job, it's just that I'm bad at platformers. I can't do a big ol' jump. If I leave this here... If Ori's willing to put it down, there we go. Yep. Oh. Jump after holding the button. Yeah, like I said before, I've... <laughs> not played in a while, it's probably going to be quite obvious. I need to get it up here somehow. Okay, how the heck do I do that? Because from what I can see on the map, oh, you can actually drop down. Okay, okay, okay. It's gonna be a pain, but okay. 
think I have to leave this here. I'm just gonna wait this out, wait this out. Ori, I need you to cooperate with me. Quit trying to grab the freaking wall. I... What is... Okay, put it down. That time you go up? What the heck and a half? Or he quit hugging the wall. Oh my gosh. I understand I have the climb ability. That doesn't mean that I want to keep on hugging the wall. Let me... Okay, I can't actually get up here. The problem I was having with the first jump part was that I wasn't holding the jump button down in order to go higher. Which, okay, that's fine. I understand how I screwed up there, but... Ori hugging the wall like that after every jump, I hated that. It's fine though, it's fine. For now, because I wasn't supposed to do it in the first place, I was breaking the game a bit. And now I have to go all the way down here, and I don't know if I'm going to be allowed to come right back up. Oh wait, do I... Alright, sure. I really just want in here so I can get an ability cell. Thank you very much. I'm willing to wait for this to come back. The ability cells are the ones I really want to get my hands on. Because to my immediate memory, we have not been getting the ability points very quickly. Ah, oh, crap. Here we go. Just going to go ahead and... Uh, Take a moment to put that down. Not that I need that particular upgrade, but there it is. Yeah, that, that section was just not meant for me enough that I want to create a save point there. Was it a good idea? Maybe. Well, probably not, but was it a good idea for me? Absolutely. Please leave me alone. Okay. Alright. Up we go. With that wall being there, I'm pretty sure I'm going to get to that special ability tree soon-ish. What's over here? Nothing? Of course nothing. Really shouldn't have made that jump, but... Here we are anyway. Aha! This is fine. It looks like there's something up there. It's no big deal. I'll come back for it later on. <sighs> keep on going, keep on going. Hello, hello, hello. Nothing to say? Alright. Oh, there's the tree. Okay, don't keep going forward. So, don't go forward. Use the very obvious platforms to go up. Which I felt like I probably should have done in the first place, but then I just kind of wanted to keep going anyway, so, you know, whatever. Probably my fault. And it happened anyway. How... Yeah. That's probably the smart thing to do. Okay, and that's how I'll turn the lights on. Where'd the where'd the orb go? Oh, I was carrying it? Alright. Somehow. Oh come on, you carried it this far and jumped around. It's not that heavy. Unless his arms are tired. Alright, cool. Now I can see things. Even though our light had grown weak in this haze, it lifted the darkness that held claim of this place. Hallelujah. Give me that ability. Eki was looking for Naro, but she was gone when he came. He was swift like the wind and sprinted with haste, but surrounded by darkness, he lost his way. 
Is this not the ability I want? Dash. To use it, press R in order to dash into the direction you're facing. Uh, this is something that I unlocked for an ability a long time ago. Okay, I need to keep on pushing it. And there's a map stone over there, so obviously I want to go this way first. Thank you very much. Is there anything else immediate right here? It doesn't look like it, so goodbye. There. Ori, come on now. You can climb that. We all know better. Don't fake it. I don't even remember what those things do anymore. Um, I can go up. There could be something to my left, even though it's not appearing on my map. That's probably fine for now. I can get it on my way back. I assume I'm going to come back. What does this do? Great! How about... That thing goes kaboom. Hi there, buddy! Good to see you. Don't... Don't talk to me, don't touch me. Don't touch, talk to me or my son ever again. Okay, remember to dash. That's kind of important. And now those things are dead. Oh, I guess I could have dashed past them, couldn't I? Yeah, I think I unlocked an ability a long time ago to be able to dash through the air. As well as on the ground. This is just something to famili familiarize you with your new ability. Excellent! New ability point. Or not, just some bonus experience. That's fine. I think they want me to save here. Also probably fine. Now that thing down there, I don't know if I could stomp on it. But maybe that'll be my exit later on. That is just all kinds of suspicious, isn't it? Alright, so that's an instant killer. Oh, I can't just hold on to that. Got it. Can I just, like... Yeah, that's probably better. Oops! Hi there, there's the ceiling that wants to crush me. <laughs> I'm observant, really. No one believes me. I wouldn't believe me either. Gonna let that go for a bit. Cool, cool, cool. That I Okay, thank goodness. What do you mean an unsafe zone? Come on. It's perfectly safe here. At this point. This is nice. And it looks like there's something up there I've already collected. What? Yeah, I've been... Oh. Well, how about that? And there's more life. Which is always a reward. And a well. Which I guess we need a cutscene for? We should return here later. There is much left unknown. Down below, we, might, may, we may find the place they once called their home. Oh. Naru's old home. Does anybody else find it strange, by the way, that we were never able to find Naru's current home? Or is that just someplace like... Somewhat off the map that already doesn't want to explore, so he kind of goes around it as we ex explore around. Oh, dear me. Oh, there's the last! Okay, I need to go back. I need to go back to that. I can go to the right. I can probably go up here and get this thing, because the water's not poisoned anymore. Maybe I can come back easy. It looks like I can come back easy. This is fine. Oh, that's right, there's, uh, wind now, I suppose. 
That is the wrong side, you ding-ding doofus. Okay, now then. Water? Not even any fish in here. I'm okay with that. There's a spike, though. I am not okay with running into that. Like, I might be moving a little too fast here, but I had to go through that entire section carrying something on my back the whole time. Say, so, hello! That would have been a welcome addition last time I played. Alright, now I'm pretty sure that's everything in here. Yeah, so I'm gonna go up to that well and uh, make my way back around, if that's okay with everybody here. Except I'm just now noticing there's something up there, and I'm a little bit curious, if you must know, what that could possibly be. And I've got the health to tank a few hits, so, you know. Why did I never get this? I'm not able to see through other areas yet. How did I miss that? Maybe I collected it and then died and forgot about it? I don't know. That is still very odd. Okay, I need to go back out down in there. I want that tree. Okay, so I guess that I probably could have gotten the dash the first time I visited this game. Maybe there was something I missed the first time. However, now I can go to the Lost Grove. Oh, that just looks all kinds of friendly, don't it? Ah, darn it. I was trying to do the boost jump in the air to get away from that thing and lock onto the wall. Didn't work. I feel like I broke something. Maybe I didn't. Oh man, there's an entire culture down here that we've lost. Go away, frog. I'm admiring the statue. There. Just go away and never come back. There's a lot down here, dude. And the background's different, too. It's like marble texture. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, and even the statue appears in the map. That's cool. That's a nice touch. All right. Um. This looks like great fun, don't it? Didn't jump, didn't jump. I knew I was going to have that problem, but I still had to do it anyway. What do we have here? Did we just go down, down to Goblin Town? When they left the lights on? Dude, go away. Just go away. Oh, don't let it look like fun! Yeah! Shoot. Well, I, I do not know the timing for this, and it's an instant kill, because of course it is. It's fine, I guess. Just the usual. Like the safe spot over here, since they're going to let me do it. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah. The dash is something I probably could have used a few times. This is, uh... Uniquely pretty, isn't it? Did I just... <laughs> did I just ignore something that was shooting at me? Oh. 
So, based on the phrasing and the actions that we just saw, is it safe to assume that the creatures of this world are either light or dark and there's nothing in between? And you just said that Naru was lightless. So, is Naru's species a dark species? I can kind of understand a little bit that that might be the case because Gumon was also not particularly friendly. But we eventually were able to befriend him and then he helped us out later, so... I could be misinterpreting that because I do that a lot with games that I don't know super well. But if that is the case, I mean, it's really interesting. It's, huh. So, okay, okay, okay. I should probably go to that thing on the right, even though it's probably most likely going to be blocked off because of that thing up there on the top. Yep, all right, so. What I'm looking for... Oh, wait a second. I can just drop down. I knew that! Pardon me, I'm just a derp sometimes. Soul could cast her light. Even the dark, in the dark she would see. She lived deep in this grove. Now she rests here in peace. Yeah, I'm sure Soul could certainly cast the light. It probably wouldn't be that hard. So now we're going to get a... ball of light we can throw to light up those little switches. Light burst. Either press or hold L in order to cast a light burst. Alright, so press. Wait, that was R. Bomf. Or I can aim it. And I can aim more than one. Alright, 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 alright. And that's what I've been missing this entire freaking time. Light it up! Light it up better. Ori. Ori, what the heck. Much better. Okay, so I need to be very precise about all this. Also, I would not have thought that uh, Ori in the Blind Forest is a game where you can unlock grenades. Which really does seem to be the case. Much gooder. All right. Oh, hey! I can't use that yet. Get in there. Nope, nope, nope. Get in there. Ori. So, how... how do? They were kind of bouncing before, weren't they? Okay, that time I bounced. Oh, I think I was hitting the thorns before, and that time... So it explodes if I hit the thorns, or any other damaging aspect, but if I hit just a flat surface, it bounces. Okay. Um... And I think I use up my energy when I do that. That's a little concerning. I guess I can make it work, but all the same, that's a little bit yikes. I can probably deal, though. Okay, so we need to get further up and keep going. Hey, boys! Huh. That is a... Okay, I kind of, I kind of thought so. Awesome. And that'll open it up permanently. Thank you very much. And in here, yes. Oh, that was two points, I think. No, it was just a full one. Because I unlocked one point earlier and I complained about it. Um, oops, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, hold on, gonna need to go back for that one. That hurt, and that was rude. No problem. Dang, that does not give me very much anymore, does it? Well, what I should probably do is get some more health. 
I'm gonna need health and energy, man. All right, um, so this entire section is Blackroot Burrows. Okay. I kind of want to go back and get some of these things I missed first. Because if there's any ability or secret areas down here, I'm going to want to be able to see them. That makes sense, right? And then a whole bunch of stuff back here like this is going to be really easy to get to. I can unlock them very easily. So I don't know if I'll go back and get everything, but there's a whole bunch of sections that I do still very much want to see. Screw you, frog. You need to die. I don't care if you land on me five times. It doesn't matter. I'm going to win. All right, so... That was impressively rude, and you should be ashamed. All right, so uh, after that death, I'm noticing that there's a lot of stuff I need to redo. Um, I'm gonna take care of that in between episodes So yeah, I'm just gonna end it off here not take too much more time on the video and uh, Boom yeah Just I'm just gonna call it the end here for now so I can get back up to where we were and definitely save the game and not uh, Completely screw things up so thanks everyone for joining me today I will see you next time on another episode of Ori in the blind forest when Oh, we've got things to see and do that have been taunting us for far too long. See you then and take care.